Thank you, Digital Arts. All right. Well, thank you for uh, again creating a beautiful this beautiful altar um, transformation for the Sacred Art of Altars exhibit and auction. And um, tell us a little bit. I'm going to kind of zoom in a little bit so that people can see the details. But tell us right. your inspiration for this piece. Well, my inspiration for that piece was um, at the time when the invitation came out, I was going through a lot of changes in my life. Um, I, I'm, a, I'm a suddenly an empty nester, so that was a little bit of an initiating moment for it. And... I've always been inspired by nature and I am particularly fascinated with uh, moths and butterflies. I'm a little bit of a, of an amateur entomologist and um, that, that altar has some moths that to me are incredibly fascinating. The moths in the altar are moths that spend the majority of their life as caterpillars and only in the last part of their life do they turn into these beautiful um, winged creatures that fly and and pollinate um, night blooming plants and that's basically what did it it's um you know it, it's kind of hard when you've been a mother and you've been all bloody things with your career like well what's left for me now you know I've done all of this but you know is, is my life over now am I supposed to turn into this little lady and um and die <laughs> and um and I take uh, umbrage in the idea of the beauty of these um creatures that spend the majority of their life as nymphs and um semi-evolved um, animals and then um, for a very very short time towards the end of their life they give this incredible show of colors and of, of prowess and um, and I just that's where I got my inspiration from. Beautiful. Now I also want to just tell everyone that part of the altar <clears throat> includes these 3D glasses. Yes. Tell us about that. There is this um, technique for painting. It's called, the glasses are chroma depth glasses. And it's actually science. I, I'm an artist, but I also love um, the natural sciences. And they work by separating the colors um, from each other and when you when you know what you are trying to do you can the color separate and appear to uh, float above the canvas yeah it's really amazing it's just um, it, it, it adds this um, just incredible depth and dimension and the colors are oh, it's just beautiful Thank it's you. really exciting Thank you. Yeah. So, so anything else you want to tell us about? The um, not really. Um, I, the only thing that I'd like to um, urge people to do is to definitely, if you've never been to Celebration Circle, definitely go to the SACI building on a Sunday. Um, a great opportunity to meet with people and to find a community for those of us that are not um, the nominated church. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for being part of this and uh, we're grateful for your presence and your creativity. Thank you. Um, anytime. Okay. Be well. Thank you. You too. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.